This is ordinary mild steel. I cut it up all the time on my wonderful CNC machine. And this is stainless steel, which I've never cut before. It's a totally different thing. Shiny, smooth and rust free and more than three times the price. This piece is two millimeters thick. I've been asked to cut out some letters and symbols for a studio sign. And this is the extreme CNC machine with an R-Tech plasma cutter. Links in the description. In case you're wondering, I'm not getting anything for promoting this product except ongoing excellent service from both teams. As usual with a new thickness or material I cut out a few test pieces before I get started. I increase the amps until it cuts cleanly and then speed up the cut as much as it will go. 42 amps at 2000 millimeters per minute seem to work fine for this, which is more amps than for mild steel. I make all the changes in a program called SheetCam and then bring it into Mac 3. This is um, me just telling the machine where to start cutting and making sure it's going to cut the right thing. And that extra noise is a very old extractor fan to blow the smoke away. And we're off. And it cut out most parts perfectly, which was a relief considering the price of the material. I did need to replace the tips three times though through the job. Despite having three types of dryer in the airline, the air is so moist here, I get through a lot of these things. One of the downsides of living where we do, perhaps. But um, I got there in the end, and this is where the main difference in stainless steel seems to be. There is a lot of hard dross on the edges. On mild steel, there's usually nothing much, and it brushes off in seconds leaving a nice clean edge but with these I have to go through each piece with a wire brush and then a grinder and finally a flap disc. The dross is hard and melted into the edge so it was much more work to clean up than usual but the advantages are obvious. What you get in the end is something clean and shiny and it doesn't need any other finishing. I'm sure there's a lot more to learn about stainless steel, but in the meantime, I think the answer to the original question is, yes, it can cut stainless steel.